and so now power stop abusing it If it me say I chew me put me life on it And M&M I like the word go ask your girl You support an M&M say word Fire views in M&M, interviews in M&M, best news in M&M Calling number 647859353 As for turning belief and faith into a sound clash, like what's the matter with you? <laughs> Yeah, these guys were here arguing about God, and one lost. How did you do that? How am I supposed to believe in God if one guy lost with God on his side? And the other guy won with God on his side? Last I checked, it was the same God. Nobody lost. This guy's telling... This guy's like, well, well, Adam said, and this guy's like, Pull it back on you! Don't be on that one, you dog! Oh, hold on a minute. This isn't a clash. You two can have this argument in the bathroom. <laughs> Um, I want to gauge the crowd. The majority, is everyone in here Jamaican for the most part? Like, do we have Jamaicans in here? Are you even enthusiastic about where you're from? <laughs> Yo, big up Shizzle Dizzle over here, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You wanted to dance during the, uh, the God Sound Clash, didn't you? I could see you, you wanted to dance during it. This guy's like, I think there's a new dance called the, the God. <laughs> <laughs> I've known Shizzle Dizzle like three years, and for three years his left arm has been broken. I don't know what it is. I think he keeps breaking his arm just so he can match his outfits. <laughs> doctor, doctor, you can't give me a yellow one for next weekend. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, I'm, I'm a comedian. And uh, I've been touring a lot, quite a bit. And it's interesting because a lot of places I go, like I'm, I'm heading out to the South a lot now, and it's interesting because there's everyone's black in the South, but barely anyone's Jamaican. And it's just, it changes a lot, but there's a few Jamaicans here and there, you know what I'm saying? I was in New Orleans and I performed, and these guys came up to me after the show, they're like, hey, yo, man, we gotta we got talk to you, bro. I'm like, hey, what's happening, man? Like, yo, 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 we really feel what you been doing there, bro. Uh, all right. Yeah, yeah, we, we Jamaican, bro. You guys don't sound Jamaican. What part of Jamaica are you guys from? Well, we're not really Jamaican. I mean, we just like it. <laughs> Americans love Jamaican. They'll be like my grandfather. He was half Jamaican on his mom's side. That doesn't make you Jamaican, though. He goes, what's, what makes you Jamaican? I go, you want to know what makes me Jamaican? My mom. You got a Jamaican mom that makes you Jamaican. Because your Jamaican mom reminds you every day that she's only concerned with one thing in her life. You know, you're, you know your Jamaican mom is concerned with in your life? It's not your well-being. She doesn't care about that. She'll call you every day, Shizzle. Shizzle! Where my Tupperware there? That's all my mom wants to know. Where my, where my Tupperware there? Where we get tech from my house come teeth? I'm like, hey, Colleen, I'm fine, by the way. Don't call me by my first name, me, I am Anna. I'm a woman, top of wear. There was a, I was in Florida for the shooting. Remember there's that big shooting at the club? I was in Florida, I was playing the improv that weekend. Huge shooting. And it was like at two o'clock in the morning, whatever, I wasn't there, I was playing the improv, but I, I, there was a huge shooting. <laughs> well, you know I wasn't there. There's no such thing as gay black people anyway. There's only like two of them. There's like, <laughs> there's RuPaul and the kid from S Club 7. I think that's it. <laughs> so anyway, there was, a, there was a shooting and my mom calls me in the morning and she's like, Quinn, you all right? I'm like, yeah, yeah, well, what's going on? She's like, you never see part of news? And I look, and there's a big shooting or whatever. I'm like, oh no, I didn't notice this. She's like, all right, all right. Where my top I wear that way? I tech three years ago. <laughs> really? That's what you called to find out? Well, if you're all right, then you can return my top I wear. And they remember what you take in the top of wear, too. Remember, you took two pieces of jerk chicken and all of the rice? How do you remember that? No, I'm the top I wear. I'm gonna wait till my mom dies. I'm gonna go to her funeral. I'm gonna bring her all the fucking Tupperware she wants. <laughs> oh, I think I can't cuss bad word in here. Sorry, I can just smoke weed out front for an hour. Sorry. <laughs> wow, what an asshole I am. Sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't. I didn't mean to swear. He said his wife comes out and then files a letter. Uh, hey, you lost the god battle. Shut up. <laughs> you can't heckle me, buddy. <laughs> Even God doesn't like you. And you haven't sworn in about 35 years. 
guy has a sword in 40 years and God's like, I'm not on your side in my debate. But you're gonna win, God, I don't want you to represent me. I want the other guy to represent me. You're gonna have a good prayer session this Sunday. God, I hope I can win the next sound clash. My song got killed off. Pick up your gun and throw them away. Yeah, all right, that's enough. <laughs> Next week, he's going against Tony Matara. <laughs> oh, man. I uh, <laughs> I never get to come to Anglican West. I love coming out here, man. Y'all are great. I'm from uh, I'm from Scarborough. That's where I'm from. You guys... Yeah, yeah. yeah. You guys ever, you guys ever really come to... You guys never really come to Scarborough. I feel like like the bus stop's running too early out there for you guys. Wait, yeah, nobody wants to reach over Scarborough. Around here, this is all 24-hour stuff, you know. This is the place you come after the club, you know what I'm saying? No matter, we can go get food, everything. It's not like that in Scarborough. In Scarborough, everything shut down at about 9 p.m. That's it. Because everywhere got robbed in, like, 2004, they just shut everything. You ever go to, like, a gas station, and you have to go to the little window? So you fill up, well, first you have to pay. You know that one, we have... You have to pay in advance, prepay. Right, and if you want to get you want to get anything, you want to get a cigarette, you want to get whatever you want, you have to go to this little window, and you have to give them the money, and then he close it, goes gets the cigarettes, comes back, and get you know they invented that because of Scarborough, because after 9:30 p.m. they were just robbing everything. Oh, you know that? Oh, I, well, my friend told me about it. <laughs> I don't know anything about robbing. <laughs> Hello, everybody. My name is Chantel Dubois. Be flex. AKA Mr. Help Support. I'm here to tell you about spectacular Thursdays that we run. I'm the CEO of NMNM News. Every Thursday right here at Sankofa, 1653 Eglinton Avenue West. And we are ordained. And we are ordained. We are ordained. We created a platform to promote artists, to showcase them and give them endorsements that our sponsors give us. Our only mission is to see that the kids we're starting from Jamaica, the basic school, kids age 3 to 6, we're providing a lunch program for them. So that we can promote them and help them get their music out, get their brand out, and let the world hear about their artistry. So I'm calling to all the world, everybody, you need to help support our cause. So make sure you come out every Thursday, it's a spectacular Thursday. Every Thursday we have a party at San Kofa. That's 1653 Eglinton Avenue West. D Flex and your girl Chantel Dubois, we will be here hosting the event and make sure that our people are heard. In case you want to check out our site, it's www.nmnmnews.com. One love, peace. Show up.